the pm garib kalyan used the technology available and therefore was able to do direct benefit transfer of cash for the various categories i just want want to quote some of these numbers now before i begin today's issue because of the size of what is shown in these figures the number of people to whom directly to their accounts money could reach because technology direct benefit transfer technology was in time adopted and implemented with such missionary zeal over the last 4 years otherwise this wouldn't have been possible at all pm kasan beneficiaries as of 16th may i'm strictly talking about the announcements and their impact one time transfer of 2000 crores or uh, 2000 rupees each has reached 8.19 crore farmers and that amount is about 16394 crores nsap beneficiary the old age and others first installment 2.812 crores of people uh, sorry uh, 1405 crores of rupees in the first installment again 1402 in the second installment the target was to give away 3000 crores and that's almost nearly achieved jan dan account holding women under the pm garib kalyan were credited into 20 crore people's accounts and that amounts to 10025 crores of rupees the building and construction workers received their financial support amounting to 3950.35 crores and their number the building and construction workers number is 2.20 crores imagine each one of these numbers and their implication in terms of size and all of them received the money directly into their accounts purely because dbt was possible 6.81 ujwala yojana cylinders have reached the beneficiaries and they were free cylinders because we had promised up to three cylinders in those three months to over 12 lakhs of epfo members of benefited by the online withdrawal of non refundable advance and that amounts to 3660 crores